teachers ought to be leaders in society who make the biggest difference in the students' lives. And I'm hopeful that AI can take the boring work away from teachers and let teachers do what teachers really um, should do and, and would be more passionate and excited and impactful for doing. Uh, if you break down the teacher's job into many tasks, some tasks that AI can do better. There are some that AI can help the teacher. Uh, but in aggregate, when you adopt all the AI in education with today's classroom setting, uh, probably 40 to 50% of the teacher's time is freed. That time, I think, should go into person-to-person -person connection so that the teacher can spend more time on the moral compass and values and uh, teamwork and compassion and creativity aspects of each individual. That, I think, is the future of education. If we think about how education has developed, it is actually incredibly backwards for the entire humanity. If we think for a moment, think about how entertainment has changed today with Netflix and YouTube and online video and interactivity compared with 100 years ago, you know, still black and white and even silent movies changed dramatically. Have your mental image of everything that we do every day, right? Um, our entertainment, communications, social, transportation, and work, all dramatically changed. But think about our mental image of a classroom, exactly the same. You still have a teacher lecturing the same way to 20, 30, 50 kids sitting there in desks. You may change from a blackboard to a whiteboard, but the teacher is still teaching the same way. And that cannot be right. Technology has uh, completely revolutionized everything, how we uh, live, play, learn, work, communicate. It has not made the impact to education. And we need to really rethink what the future of education needs to be. If we think about the skill set, artificial intelligence will take away the routine jobs. Yet most of the education in most countries are still teaching each child to be the same robotic, test-taking, high-scoring robot. And children or students will never beat AI in memorizing, studying, conceptualizing, multiple choice, doing math equations, doing uh, chemical equations and formulas, uh, and remembering history. It will never beat AI. So we're teaching children all the wrong things. I think education needs to be rebooted, restarted. Education for the future of the children needs to focus on what, on what humans need to be. Not teaching kids to be AI, but teaching kids to do things AI cannot do. It needs to have a much bigger component on the three C's. When I say three C's, I mean curiosity, critical thinking, and creativity. It needs to have much bigger component on teamwork, communication, collaboration, rather than doing each homework individually, doing tests individually, competing against each other on grades. That's the wrong way. As we know in companies today, it's about teamwork, it's about collaboration, it's about communication. That's what we need to teach. We need to teach love and empathy and how to win trust. Those are things that need to be added. Uh, yes, there still needs to be learning of the basic skill sets, math and language and so on, but those are, are just foundational elements. That's more the foundation, not the main substance. Um, so unless we make a big change to education uh, and change education from training repetitive routine robots into training creative, compassionate humans, if we don't make that transition, the future will be very bleak because the graduates of college will be unable to take the tasks and jobs that in 15 or 20 years that we humans will need to have. There will be a huge mismatch we will have graduates who still want to be office workers and number crunchers and filers and writers and editors of routine basic content. We're going to need graduates of college to become critical thinkers, creatives, strategic thinkers, and compassionate and empathetic people.